Hey everyone, this is Rochelle and welcome to Multiple Passive Streams of Income. This week I'm working from home and when I work from my job, I have a two monitor desktop computer setup. Some of my work requires utilizing spreadsheets that have a lot of columns. I can minimize the spreadsheet by using the slider at the bottom right of my screen, but the data on the spreadsheet becomes so tiny that I can't really see the data clearly. So I had this old monitor, pre-HDMI monitor, the one you use with a VGA cord. Millennials now, don't you judge me. After I dust it off and hook everything up, Go into the settings, I get everything working, and then the screen looks like this. I scoured YouTube for hours trying to figure out how I can get this to be a full screen. I couldn't drag the sides to expand the spreadsheet. There was all of these YouTube videos suggesting to adjust some of the monitor settings. I was uninstalling and reinstalling drivers. I mean, nothing worked and I actually never found the solution. I'm thinking maybe more modern monitors utilizing HDMI just don't have this problem and that's why I'm not finding any solutions online. So I go to three different Staples locations because I need this two monitor system at home now. I don't think so. The laptop I have is a ThinkPad with a detachable keyboard and tablet capability. It has no USB ports. It only has two ports, the port to attach the power cord and this small square port. Now that was a whole nother adventure trying to figure out what this port is called. It ends up the port is called a mini display port, not to be confused with a regular display port. They're two totally different connections. What? When I get to Staples, none of the three locations have any of the mini display port adapters. Yes, I could order online, but this week happens to be during the COVID-19 pandemic and stuff that is being delivered is delayed. Even Amazon Prime isn't able to get their two-day delivery completed. So here's a possible workaround. My laptop has Windows 10. If you have a TV that recognizes Wi-Fi, you can use the TV as your second monitor. And you don't need any cords because the Wi-Fi does the connection for you. It's real easy. If you are unsure if your TV recognizes Wi-Fi or not, just turn your TV on and follow these steps. On your computer or laptop, click on the notifications icon. It's located at the bottom right of your screen. It's a column size screen will expand from the right and you have to click expand to see all of the options. Find connect and click on it. Now, all the devices that are on Wi-Fi and that are discoverable will appear in a list. Make sure your TV's turned on when you do this. This is how you'll be able to tell if your TV is Wi-Fi compatible or not. If it is, click on your TV from the list that you see. You'll see a connecting message on your TV. When the connection is made, whatever was playing on your TV will shut off and you will see your computer or your laptop screen on the TV. Now for this to work, your laptop and your, and your TV or your computer and your TV have to be on the same Wi-Fi connection. Now move the mouse around across the screens to get used to the mouse movements. Open up programs on either device and drag what you need from computer screen to TV screen and vice versa. So I ended up having to order a monitor and a mini display port HDMI adapter from online. But thankfully, this workaround gets the job done until I receive my items in the mail. Because I haven't received them yet and that was last week. Thanks for your time as I know you could be any other place right now. Take care.